I'm Asa Clark, I'm here for seconds out with Nathan Brown. Nathan, how was the fight? The fight was good, the fight was hard. Uh, I've been a year out, but it was good to get them solid eight rounds in against a solid operator. Um, Mark's a very strong and game competitor. And he's not, uh, obviously, he's a journeyman, but he's a journeyman who tries to take your head off. He doesn't try and hold back on that and get you through the rounds. Any opportunity he had, he tried to take my head clean off. So it was good getting them rounds in after, after the young, long layout, layoff. Um, it's good to get them in. I mean, he, throughout the fight, he looked like he looked, like he was either going to get knocked out, or or you were he was you know you were going to knock him out, or knock him out. Did you find it difficult because he was so such an awkward opponent? Sort of. After being, I say, after being, I'm not using excuses. You know, every fighter has the layoffs, but um, yeah, he was he was a tough kid. Um, he was very moved his head, couldn't land clean, and when it did land clean, I obviously I done done a bit of damage to the right hand. So. After that, it was just sort of going on autopilot and letting the engine do most of the work then, just flicking the punches out and getting the rounds out and, as you say, staying well away from them big bombs because um, he's got his well in case capabilities of switching people's lights off. So. Yeah. I was speaking to your corner, obviously, you would have done him probably earlier, but uh, you've done your hands in, haven't you? Yeah, that's, it's, a, it's a common occurrence for me doing my hands, so I'm used to it. Um, but it's one of them things, it's boxing, and I'm just... Uh, one of them fighters who, who suffer with bad hands. It's just part and parcel of the sport. So go back to the drawing board and, and um, obviously we'll be back. There's no serious damage. I'll be back into the gym in a couple of weeks and then looking for a new date. Good. And um, have you spoken to your manager or the corner yet about what you want to do next after this fight? Now you've won or not? Not yet, no. Um, obviously we'll we'll debrief probably just through the week in the gym. We'll get in, we'll see where it went wrong, where it went right. and. Um, address the situation and address uh, where we go from here um, what, what opponents are next and getting that fight out the way I know I suffered with bad hands and it went the distance with Mark but now that, that the rust has been shed I want to start jumping in with kids now in, in the top 10 you know maybe top 5 and start start mixing it with the best in Britain great stuff cheers